to Weather Plus forecast with meteorologist Tony Pan. I take it you didn't like the harpoon that I got you for Christmas last year? The, no, the duct tape was for Sarah. I know where you guys got these. <laughs> you guys going down my Christmas list and putting them on TV. All right, uh, weather wise today, obviously we started out with some fog this morning, but unlike yesterday, the fog burned off and it turned out to be uh, pretty nice. Temperatures this afternoon are going to climb up close to 60 degrees in most areas. It's already 60 downtown, it's 59 at the airport, 56 in Sykesville, 50 degrees in Rising Sun up in Cecil County. So all the uh, fog is gone now. The visibility is still only six miles in Annapolis. That's mostly just haze. There's a little bit of fog left in the mountains. And if you're traveling up 83, say, into southern Pennsylvania, there might be some light fog uh, left around York. But uh, most of it is gone now. And if you still have some fog in your neighborhood, it should be dissipating very shortly. So right now we have a lot of sunshine. It's hazy sunshine. But there's a few high-thin clouds out in the mountains that may drift in here late this afternoon and this evening. But we'll call it uh, partly to mostly sunny. For the rest of the day. And in general, high pressure will be in control of the weather over the weekend. Right now, it's anchored down in Virginia, and that means dry conditions uh, and it's going to warm up. Uh, you're going to like the seven day forecast. There is one little system we're watching, though. It's going to pass by north of us, producing some rain and even some snow in the southern part of Canada. That will continue to track off to the northeast, and that's going to be the trend over the next couple of days. These storms will develop, pass west of us, and pretty much leave us alone here in the mid Atlantic. And watch what happens to the jet stream. I'm going to set the time frame into Sunday morning. See this huge ridge on the east coast. Whenever you see that on the map, again, it means warm conditions. There's going to be a lot of snow in the Plain States and back into the Rocky Mountains, and the Pacific Northwest is going to stay very active. But here on the east coast, it's going to be quiet. Temperatures are going to jump into the 60s. We might even come close to a couple of records over the weekend and into the beginning of next week. So the forecast goes like this. A mixture of sunshine and a few clouds this afternoon. Mild highs in the upper 50s and low 60s. The normal high is 47. Uh, the winds will just be light and variable, picking up out of the south at 5 or 10 miles per hour. Now, tonight we could see some fog redevelop again late. Uh, if it does, it's not going to be as thick as the last couple of days. The temperatures drop back into the upper 30s and low 40s. Seven day forecast. Again, if you're a snow fan, look away. The rest of you, soak it in and enjoy it. 63 with sunshine Friday, 65 with sunshine Saturday. If you're going to the Ravens game on Sunday, 67 degrees. Some places in Maryland could even hit 70, I think, on Sunday. Next chance for rain, Monday next week.